Consider it done. Set a course, navigator. I'm sensing a black pearl on Dreadvine's code. We should wait. Hmm. Is that the red male I sense at the edges of my consciousness? Greetings, Dreadvine. You wouldn't know anything about a black pearl on your island. You are not the first ones to ask for this little bauble the brine brought in. A magistratus has been incessant about it. His hollow threats have long stopped being amusing. We could silence him for you, in exchange for the pearl. I fail to see why I would give up such a valuable object of study. Would you rather wait until the Inquisition pries it from you? All right. Take care of the Magistratus, and then we can negotiate. I smell dishonesty here. Don't worry, Navigator. I have a plan. Now, choose our entry. Soul is razor sharp. One, two, knockout. I'll be there soon. I like it already. Grant me a second. I'll step on a chair on you. Oh, I can do lots of things. I do like this so far. Opportunity calls. Back to the sea! Ah. Back on the top! I'll knock some sense into your gaff. Don't worry. I'll drown you yeah, later. Let me at him. Let's see what's out. No cover? You wanna hide, yeah? Can you hear the waves? Never look back. Aye. Let's stretch those all the way up to oh, soon, I see. Eh? At your ah, side. Always from the ground. Ah. This will not go away. We shall see every last one of the cursed pearls delivered to the fire. No second thoughts, eh? Ah. You approach the Magistratus. How will you dispose of him that is on too large? Something direct, I like. Very well. I shall observe your stumbling with mild curiosity. If I may ask, why do you tolerate the Zenets? They right. provide a fits? modicum of distraction. Not that there's much new to learn. Their idiotic dogma changes little. Still, Playing with fire does have it. Careful, Dread. You know what the fire can do. So, lady, how kind of you to care for my well-being. Or is this just another ploy to steal my secrets? 
Ugh, forget it. I stand ready. Let's get moving, eh? I like these odds. I will leave it to the cursed brush. It has endured. Mr. Mercury, at the ready! Watch me go! Sure, I could take him. Consider it done with the dead folks guy. <laughs> Remedies for the dead. Swift shrub, come into what do we have here? <laughs> My power lights. <laughs> Nobody will find me here. The devils have released me. Hmm, so you've managed to silence the annoying Magistratus. I admit this did prove a slight distraction. Now, if you I have ancient questions to ponder. <clears throat> what is it now, Marlin? You know I do not take kindly to interruptions. May I remind you that you owe us a black pearl? I remember agreeing to no such thing. Neither do I feel inclined to <laughs> negotiate what? now. In that case, let me use my power to undo our actions. Then we will leave you to the Magistratus's ramblings. Very well. Have your precious pearl, if you must. I have delivered it to the Watchtower at the Shattered Cliffs. I trust you are able to collect it yourselves. With pleasure, almighty oh Dread Vine. I hope that memory serves us right. Let's go, Sir Reginald. You speak of fate, prognostic. The death is called. Yet I have trouble believing that you're all. Crack on top required. A pirate's delight. Meditate before the flame. <laughs> Clean this place sometime. The Black Pearl is ours. I hope this concludes our problem. No threats of time undone remain. None at all, Dreadvine. It was a pleasure doing business with you. Aye, and do feel free to call us again. We do enjoy your generosity. Ugh. Pirates. Now we're getting somewhere. We want to be better, greater than we are right now. Glad you have our backs. Still Iron gets untempered. A sea flows through me. The Inquisitor. There, the Black Pearl is ours. I hope this concludes our bargain. No threats of time undone remain. None at all, Dreadvine. It was a pleasure doing business with you. Ah, and you feel free to call us again. We do enjoy your generosity. Ugh, pirates. Let's 
go under, but I'm ready. Nothing in cheap. That's what we do. It seems our work is never done. Aye, measure is uns. Belief requires the absence Meditate. Hey! Try this Straight to the room. point. <laughs> A crack in the glass. Lights be chaos. Stay down, will you? Oh, I'll have to knock that down. Come in right up. It's all in the world. What's in it for me? Well, well. Forgive my insolence. Need something, matey? At your service. Well, well. You need a patch for that chest wound? Standing around, catching light. Oh, I like that. Mmm. Shows from the air. Burn it lighter. I must say, see Never look back. You never cease to amaze, Marley. Oh, want some more, eh? You Treatment's ready. Strange. Let's try again. Ah, oh, crack my bark there. Let's cover this up. You are still young. At your service. I like ah. these arts. Let's stretch those roots. Oh, this is fascinating. What's in it for me? Always move forward. What ails your soul today? Ha, I have just the thing. Never look back. Your help is appreciated. Six grams of death root, two drops of moon shots. You wanna hide? Yeah. You burn it later. Working on it. My soul is razor sharp. Consider it done. Oh, I'll have to note that down. I'm coming, Sir Agent Old. The gates have released me. Let's go, Sir Agent. Go back to the top. My power lights me. The gates Let's have get moving, me. eh? You have our backs. Now we're Way getting somewhere. Here. Back to the sea. Opportunity calls. Ah, oh, glad to be back. Time is on our side. Oh, oh, glad to be my side. Lady at the ring. Swift draw coming through. 
What do we have here? Ah, I'm <laughs> Let's see what's up. I gotcha. Oh, no problem. Oh, I like that. Cover seeds. Treatments ready. Those constant nightmares. Perhaps a confessor can help. Changed here, I see. Back on the top to be one with the seas. <laughs> Nobody will find me here. Whoops, your power scares the leaves off me, John. Ah, that's bone branching. <laughs> Commissarius mustn't know. My soul is razor sharp. <laughs> the turtles would like some matey. Oh, up, up we go. Oh, no problem. This plan's growing on me. Let the leaves cover all. Yeah, let me at them. Mr. Mercury, at the ready! <laughs> Nobody will find me here! Remedies for the dead. And yet, we must carry on. <laughs> Cover siege. I can hear voices. Can we keep that one for later? Voices. All right, easy fix. Wanna go somewhere else? Coming right up. Hmm. What's in it? Oh, it's me, the swires. Perhaps a confessor. Ah, back to the next. Commissarius. <laughs> Goodness gracious, you're heavy. I'm coming, son, Angel. Back on. Let's see what's up. Lights be chaos. Oh, 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 look at you all fast with that. It seems our work is never done. I dreamt last night. I can't even say. Perhaps a confess. We repeat. I can't even say. Finish your task. What do we have here? Opportunity calls. My power lies below. Nothing changed here. The depths have the least way. The depths call. Back on the top. Ah, sure is the At your service. This will be fun to come back to. I do like this so far. They forget, we remember. This plan's growing on me. My measure is unceasing. What's in it for me? Consider it done. Clean through the chest. <laughs> hey! Try this fruit. Watch me go. Ah, souls from the ground. Hiding spot coming up. Cover seeds. Now, where do I get those seeds? Oh, this is fascinating. Why are they 
so afraid of you. Oh, I like that. Let's get moving, eh? Let's go, Sir Reginald. Yes, of course. Nothing is back on the top. Careful to be one with the seas again. Go clean this place sometime. Oh, I can pull lots of things. Let me just take notes on that. Coming right up. Come on, Sir Reginald! Yes, of the least. I'm coming, Sir Reginald! Just another moment! Standing around, catching light. Pure dead brilliant! Ugh, leaves are itching. The sea flows through me. Remind me never to get on your bad side, John. My power lies below. A barbican. <laughs> Nobody will oh, find me I'll have here. To write that down. Well, well. Ah, let's stretch those roots. Well, no. Mm. Smells from the well, air. My orders are clear. Working on it. At your service. Straight to the pot. Look at you, old fast and stabby. Ah! Some deaths have released me. Ah! Opportunity costs. Ah! Glad to be back. This one is. Remedies for the dead. Let's go on the My soul is razor sharp. Oh, uh, I like it all with visions. Mr. Mercury, at the ready. You picked the right bone. The depths have released me. The depths call. Back on the top. To be one with the seas again. Deaths have released me. Fear I'm coming, Sir Reginald. I'll step on a shell or two. Strangers in the air. A nice ball. Congratulations. <clears throat> I... That's going to slow me down. Pirates still I gotta clean this place sometime. Hmm? You keep that anchor away from me, you got it? <laughs> to be one with the sea. Back on the top. Good call, Marley. Goodness gracious, you're heavy. That's what we do. I can feel my power in my head. Nothing changed here, I see. The deaths have released me. Let's go. That's not yet possible. Back on the top. Hmm. Ah. Ah. The deaths have released me. Ah. Back to the Marley. Experiments of will.
Straight to the point. <laughs> what can I do you for? There you are, finally. Took you long enough. Ugh, why did I come here again? For the checkup, of course. All right, let's have a look at you. Sit. Oh, sure. Hmm. Is that a good or a bad? Hmm. Sword through the chest, going towards purple on the soul spectrum. That wound in your chest. Let me touch your arm for a second. Oh, your body is weird. You're phasing in and out of reality. That is how it works for me, I. Fascinating. Let me just note that down. That is one mighty notebook. Hey, don't look so surprised. You know how many strange things I see on a daily basis? You'd think after over a century of living with the curse, we'd stop finding new things. Doesn't seem to bother you, though. Phasing in and out of... What? I said that doesn't seem to bother you. Oh, it's great. The curse is one of the greatest mysteries of our age. And you're looking at the girl who's gonna finally solve it. Lofty goals for someone so young. Hey, hey. Judging by your soul aura, I'm a lot older than you. Didn't mean to offend. You've got guts, ship doctor. Speaking of which, how's my checkup? Huh? Oh, yeah, 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 you're fine. Don't you have to do more of a check-in? No, all done. I got all I needed when I touched your arm. You're in good health for a corpse. If you ever turn into a skeleton, it'll be a fashion choice. You can go now. Good talk, Afia. Yeah, good talk. Spectrum purple. Permanent wound? Travels through space-time? Oh, I can grow lots of things. Ah, that's bloody painting. I just caught a break. Aye, Aethia. Let me guess. You've got the starfish intestines, but now you're looking for the turtle eggs. Ah, you've heard about the recipe. Great. Yes. I talked to the Marley after our conversation, and she told me the entirety of it. I knew she secretly enjoyed it. Honestly, I'm sure that she actually despises it. Ah, you learn to read her moods. If she really loathed it that much, I'd be long back on the bottom of the sea. If you say so. Anything I can help you with? Aye, so Sir Reginald and I are still at zero out of three ingredients. We were wondering if you'd seen any. Well, there was a skeleton running around with a bottle of whiskey. Strange thing was that it wasn't drinking it. Ah, a skeleton that didn't drink its whiskey? Strange indeed. I haven't seen it since. So I couldn't tell you where it is, unfortunately. Nah, you helped me plenty enough. I'll search for it myself. All right, let's see if we can find that skeleton stuck in the whiskey. Ah, sure as the tunnels. Hello there, my bony friend. Would you happen to know about a certain bottle of whiskey? Whiskey tasty. Yeah, I agree. Now, where could it be? Yes. Yes. Yes to what? Whiskey. Can't disagree with you there. Mm, don't think that's the right bones. Gotta ask around more. A farmer I'll knock some sense into your daft head. Say, bony lass, would you happen to know about... Whiskey... Yes, exactly. Head... Below... Ah! You hid something in the below. Wait, you think the skeleton stored whiskey for me in the below? Rot... Dad... Whiskey below. Great! Should I just whack you to the below with my anchor so you can get it back? Yes. Oi, that's very kind of you. I'm gonna hold back a bit. 
won't keep them doom for long. I'm coming, Sir Agent Old. In this place, some deaths have passed. All right, if we understood that manky old skeleton correctly, it should turn up with our whiskey eventually. Let's just go to our corner of the Marley and wait a bit. The turtles would like that. There you are! Whiskey... Take... That's plenty of whiskey! Easily as much as I need! How did you know? Soap... Ages... Ah! Oh, you lot remembered my recipe! I'd be teary if I wasn't drenched already! I gotta let the Marley know! Let's go, Sir Reginald! Marley, guess what? I just got the whiskey. The skeletons remembered the recipe. Did they now? Yes, yes, and it's good whiskey. I tell you, this year it's going to be a good cleaning. Right, because last time your soap burned a hole in my deck that you yourself had to patch. Yeah, I definitely overdid it with the turtle eggs that time, but luckily I am a shipwright as well, right? Besides, better one tiny hole instead of ghost rot over the entire deck. Now, next I gotta ask Toya about the other ingredients. See you around, Marley. Let's get moving, eh? No second thoughts, eh? Von Preiswald, at your service. Von Preiswald, at your service. Gentlewoman, uh, kindly blow out the candles, if you will. Candles? You mean the sun? Upon my revival, I was immediately confronted with a somewhat dim individual who thought it possible to quench the light of the sun. Those must be your famous memoirs you're composing, Pinkas van Preswal, quartermaster of this cursed voyage. Ah, so you do know a little about what is what. Then who are you, if not a severely neglectful steward? A Fia Monicato, navigator and advisor on this eventful treasure hunt. A navigator? Huh? I wasn't even aware we needed one. To this day, I'm still unsure what benefits you bring to the table yourself, Quartermaster. Would you like to show us at the training deck? Ha! I will not deny anyone a demonstration of my brilliance. The burdens of nobility. You haven't finished your trip. Good work, Quartermaster. Your presence is required in the riddle hold. To the stairs, if you please. Nothing I can't afford. Pinkus! I, Pinkus Bravos Pernilian Perselfans, von und zu Presswand, quartermaster par excellence and arbiter of good taste. It seems my brilliance has left the magic here speechless. My work is done. I shall retire to my quarters.
Navigator, I believe it's time we unearth the secrets of the riddle hole. Talk to Estelle when you're ready. Aye, aye. Good snout. Greetings, Marley. It is with great indignation that I, Pincus von Presswald, report back for duty. Quartermaster, I presume the books are going to be back in order soon. Ah, oh, Marley, must I get back to the drudgeries of everyday work already? I have eternity to get to these books you're so readily teasing me with. The captain assigned you to the task. If you're unwilling, the skeletons can always use another hand. Don't we have enough hands already? How many are there, anyway? An excellent question. Perhaps if you kept the books, we'd have an answer to it. Oh. Quartermaster? Apologies, Marley. My mind must have drifted off momentarily. What were you saying? The books. Please have a look at them. Ah, yes, surely. And such books they will be. Generations will revel in these writings, and they'll all know our tale. Let me get right to it. Opportunity cards. I'll be there, You're sir. here to serve, I presume. Atheon, I'm sure you came to experience the telling of my arrival on the morning. Well, I was actually just walking by. Why, I hear you ask, would such a refined, noble gentleman seek hospitality on such a comparably shabby pirate voyage? No, again, I only happen to be walking by. Oh, no, no, don't be shy. It is a good question. See, it all began the day I was born, January the 26th, 1615, which by now is a much-discussed topic in many of my memoirs. You have multiple memoirs? Of course. I very early on decided that one such volume wouldn't suffice. But let's not get sidetracked. On that fateful day, I vowed to live a life full of adventure and to record my exploits. You vowed that on the day you were born? Well, maybe 14 years later, but who is keeping track, really? I thought that's precisely what you're doing in your memoirs. Uh, yes, well observed. Uh, now I've lost myself. Why are you here again? I actually was just passing by, so no real reason. Perfect. I don't have time anyway. Uh, see, there are already three more chapters I have to write down. Uh, the first concerns itself with... Don't worry about explaining it. I don't want to hold you back. See you, Pincus. How very considerate. Goodbye, Aphia. I like these arts. Ahoy there, Estelle. You know where we're going. <laughs> yes, yes. Riddle hold now, bananas later. The path has opened. Proceed, navigator. Straight to the point. <laughs> Well, well. Another ominous door. Look at that scar. I'd say it's missing an eye. An eye? Hmm. Tell me, do you know where the captain's nickname came from? Black Eye Mordecai. Always assumed he got that in a brawl. A brawl? Please. It was because he truly had a black eye. He claimed that it was once touched by a creature from the deepest below. And if he didn't keep it covered, it would show him the future and drive him mad. Futures left untold. So that's the final relic. And where's his black eye now? That is the catch. Most likely, 
The captain's eye is still in the captain's skull. Ah, the one Ignatia has, I presume. I navigate her. We must take it from her. We must prepare our move against Ignatia. I have gathered everyone at the map table. <laughs> 